What's in the box today? Drumsticks. A case. A strap. Another box. A drum key. And a drum. This video is sponsored by Glary, the maker of this snare drum. I've reviewed plenty of budget instruments before, but this snare drum is only $59.99. The drum is pretty standard, it's 14 by 5 and a half and has 10 lugs, but like I showed, it also comes with a drum key, a pair of sticks, a strap if you're into that, a stand, and a stylish carrying case. If you want to check out more about this drum, you can follow the link in the description. But today, I want to take this drum in its stock form and see how it sounds, and then completely overhaul this thing. So new heads, new hardware, everything. And then we'll see if making all those improvements makes much of a difference. So first, let's order some new parts. Let's start simple with the air vent. You know, Let's do all brass hardware. $4.13. Now let's get some brass tension rods. I need 20 of these. There's only one of these in stock. Okay, uh, we'll come back to that. Two inch double ended tube lug. We want brass. We want screws. That shell's probably quarter inch. I should probably check, but it's probably quarter inch. $78.90. Now we need a throw off and butt plate. Here is the three position butt plate, $28.04. Okay, I found what appears to be the only one online, $48.99 at the cart. These are the only 14 inch 10 hole die cast brass hoops I could find. This is the batter side hoop, $49.99 at the cart. And now we need the snare side, $49.99. Add to cart. Back to the tension rods, the next best thing I could find are these inch and 9 16 tension rods. Hopefully they're long enough, they should be. So we want brass, don't need any washers. They have plenty of these in stock. So let's get 20, $14.80, add to cart. So I already have heads, um, I have snare wires. Let's grab some straps though. These are expensive, $7.24 for uh, four pieces of plastic. Add to cart. That is everything, now we wait, there's more. I realized I'll need a wrap for this because some of the holes won't exactly line up, but thankfully a buddy of mine gave me one a while ago because he wasn't very happy with the quality, which I don't blame him, but I looked it up and that cost $32. So that brings the subtotal to $390.02. But the rims and the throw off I bought from different stores, all the other stuff I got free shipping, but the rims, the shipping was $11.55. Then the throw off was $10. So that brings the grand total to $411.57.
So was it worth it? Let me know what you think in the comments. Myself, I really don't think it was. Sure, it looks cool, but if you're gonna go all out, you might as well spend a little bit more money on another shell and make a snare drum from scratch. If anything, I would just replace the heads and call it good. I'm sure if I redid the bearing edges and especially the snare beds because they were a bit short and shallow, it would sound just a little bit better, but again, considering the snare is only $60, it's totally worth that price and sounds good stock. So once again, big thanks to Glary for sponsoring this video. Links to this drum will be down below in the description.